And we continue another incredible day here at Moser Yaimi with Hachzeik. We're holding in the 11th chapter of Mesilas Yisharim, page 176 in the art scroll, Mesilas Yisharim. And it continues the Ramchal explaining this Midah of Nikios. And as yesterday we began this 11th parak, this parak is titled of all the different Pratim of Nikios. So says the Ramchal on page 176 that what are some of these classical examples in which Chazal deemed to be considered theft, stealing, and therefore we can arise at the conclusion that Rubam, Kemat Kulam, or Oiver on Gezela. Says the Mesil Zishar Mekfar, part to us, Apoilim, Ois, and Eitzel, Balab, Ha'is. The Chacham, and Gemara, Bracha, is taught us, our potter, those that are doing work, someone who's an hourly worker, so he's not allowed to go and bench. You're on the clock of the boss. How are you allowed to take out time from benching? You want to say Kriyishma? Many of us are learning Dershim Mishtabura as well. So we all know the Yavazman for saying Kriyishma. So you want to say it. But Chazal said just the first parish is a bare bone minimum. So if you're being paid per hour, that's what you have to do. Kavachaymer, the Dirya shows certainly other optional mitzvahs. If you're an hourly worker, you're getting paid per minute per hour, you are forbidden from taking off time for different shows for optional matters. Who are you to take off from the Baal And if you transgress, that's called Gezela. So paints the Ramchal a picture why many are either on Gezela. Continues to be still Sisharim. When he was working, he wouldn't even say Shalom while working. He didn't want to take his mind off of the work. From the work. Says explicitly, and he articulates by day. I worked in the heat, and by frost, by night, and my sleep was lifted from my eyes. So Yaakovinu shows us the dedication and the absolute full cons- con- consum- cons- consuming nature of an hourly worker. So says to Silshar, Mayana, what are those going to answer? Someone who's working and he's allowing himself to indulge and he's allowing himself to enjoy and be mavatal and not working to his fullest. Or if they attend to their own business, each person doing his own thing, answering perhaps his own emails and doing his own stuff, but you're on the clock of the boss. How are you allowed to do those things? So says the Ramchal, what's the general rule? If one is paid by, paid by his friends for any work, all his hours are sold to him. It's not my time anymore, it's your time, you the Balabas. It's considered a sale for the day. And therefore, whatever he takes for himself in whatever manner it is, it's good. If he wants to be Michael, me. Fine, but let's say he's not. He doesn't have to be Michael, even if not, Yom Kippur does not atone for such a sin. Continues the Ramchav, and not only that, if one does a mitzvah when he's supposed to be working, it's not a mitzvah, it's not meritorious, oh, I'm such a sadic. No, you're not. It's not a mitzvah. It's an avera to transgress. It's not a mitzvah. Transgression cannot be a mitzvah. That Hashem hates. He loves justice and he hates the carbon ayla that's brought via robbery, via theft. Similarly, we find the Gemara Baba Kama, when he stole a saw of wheat, he ground it up, he baked it, and he made a bracha. Oh, you think you're making a bracha? You're blessing God, thank you for this bread. No, you're not. It's blasphemy. What was the one who makes the defender, their accuser? You think you're blessing Hashem? No, you're not. 
you're picking this up and you're proclaiming to God, I was over on Gzela. And similarly, like we find with regards to stolen Lulav. And finally, the Ramchal finishes off today's shir and says, And Svara and logic teaches us, Just like no one's going to go over his friend, rip off his watch and just walk away. Stealing time is no less. Just like if I go and I steal someone's tefillin rachman al and then I go put them on, it's not a mitzvah, it's a veira. So too, it's the same thing if you steal time. And with this, the Ramachal teaches us, Nikias, how careful we have to be from the smallest, minutest of actions, as almost everyone is. He said yesterday, he's over on Gazila, and today he painted us the grim picture. Because whenever you're working for someone per hour, very, very quickly, you're treading on things. In water, we'll pick up from here in the next year. Visiata Dishmaya.